Hello everyone. Let me get my chair. Hold on. Oh. Thank you very much for joining me today for another quick bullet journal spread. Um, if you've been kind of following my bullet journal obsession journey that I've been on the last couple of weeks, you will know that I have been trying to put one of these out um, a day. Why? Because it's just it's just fun to do. Hold on a second. I just need to, these corners are rounded and it keeps grabbing. Okay. So what are we doing in today's video? Today, we are going to pull out some Live Love Posh. And yes, I know that this is spring elements and we are still in the midst of summer. But can you get more beautiful than these gorgeous flowers? I mean, seriously. And then and then a little boot. I mean, to me, flowers are also summer. I, I get the whole thing, but I know that right now I'm looking at my beautiful flowers outside in my yard. And, you know, the spring is when they bloom, but by midsummer is when they're beautiful. So what better way to celebrate more summer with more flowers? And I've got two washies, and I think today, now I used this book in my last um, in my last video. That's why it was just kind of hanging out here. And I really, really wanted to use these scalloped stickers. So I think I am good, because there is a little bit of gray in here. I'm gonna pull in gray and black and pink. Um, and we will see, probably not so much the colored boxes. Um, I'll see if I have enough I, I may not. I may bring in like some of the teardrop boxes. I don't know. We'll see. But I want to use this again because I really, really wanted to use these these scalloped boxes because they are they very they're very pretty. I really do. I don't know. I know that Happy Planner came out um, in their bright boxes book. They did come out. Let's see if I have it here near me. Probably not. Oh, here it is. I know Happy Planner did come out with boxes. I think they were in here. Maybe not. I thought one of their books, they came out with a bunch of scalloped boxes. Maybe it wasn't in here. Um, and I don't know really how well they kind of took off. Uh, yeah, maybe it was in another one. I, th I thought Happy Planner did one in one of in one of their books, um, but uh, I don't. I'm not seeing a whole lot of people using them in in um, in their planners. So anyway, I'm gonna give it a shot because I think they're pretty. Um, if I do have to pair it up with, you know what I mean, with some um, not squiggly boxes, but just regular black boxes, then we can. I can absolutely do that too. So. Of course, I always start off with my washi tape, and I think today I'm gonna go, oh, look at that. Oh, maybe is it long enough? Oh, it is. I think today we are gonna go straight up the middle. How about that? And I apologize if you hear my grand dog who's laying next to me snoring. She is terrible. I'm not kidding you when I tell you that she can wake up the entire house. Oh my God, Stormy. All right, am I gonna be able to get this? Okay, I just gotta be careful in where I pull it. Yeah, she's really bad. I don't know how my daughter sleeps with that. Okay, what do I wanna do it this way? I want to do it this way because I want the stripes, the vertical stripes to go with. Okay, so we're going to do it that way. I think it is time for me to do another washi tape um, run. Let me... That. Okay, and then we're going to put a thing of black here. And 
it is time for a new blade. We're going to put this one here. This is just so relaxing for me to do. Right now, the house is quiet. My grand dog is snoring. <laughs> and, uh, and yeah. And then I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some on the edge. So I haven't done any videos with it yet because, number one, they would be about it two hours long because it's taking me a while. But... Um, I've been working on Dutch doors because I think it's just so super cool. And um, I found a couple of um, bullet journal ladies channels. I think Amy, Amy Plans. Amy, oh God, I forgot what her name was. Amy Plans All, something like that. I'll link her below. And I know that Amanda... Um, plans with Amanda has been doing them and of course there are just those those other bullet journals uh, channels out there that are just phenomenal and um, so I've been practicing a little bit with those um, I did my first one yeah I did my first one <laughs> not the best in the world I am waiting for a couple of more cutters to come in So um, to make things a little bit easier, I do want to print off some of my own stickers. Okay. All right. Well, that's kind of cool. Kind of like that. All right. So let's grab some stickers here. And I'm going to try to actually utilize my... Um, because I will probably need to wash and tape away my wax paper. All right, so let's go back. This is the cutest book ever. I just ordered um, Live Love Posh's. Jessica's, not Live Love Posh's. I just ordered Jessica's um, fall book which I think is going to be so fun. Yes, because fall is going to be here before everybody knows it. Okay, so let's go with this one. And then I want that boot. Ugh. So how about if we put boot there? Let's put flower pot here oh I like that one that oh my god it has butterflies okay all right we're just gonna put it down because that's what I want okay we're gonna put flower pot there we're gonna put little boot over here okay Let's grab a couple of butterflies. I'll put one there. Um, let's do this other one. Let's do this one right there. Cute! Loving it! All right, before I go any more crazy with those beautiful stickers, I have to put boxes down. So let's grab... Let's grab these. So do it inside the line or over the washi. Let's bring it down a little bit and just kind of go over the washi a little bit. And then we will layer that. Okay. Let's grab this gray one. Okay, so if you haven't noticed, when I do my bullet journals, my brain has to make each side somewhat symmetrical. Because I, I can't, I don't know, I've tried it before and 
there was one point when I literally pulled up all of the stickers because I couldn't get them down right. Symmetrics is a, is a, is a big thing for me. So sorry if everybody finds that boring, but what are you going to do? I think I have two pages of these. Yes. Okay. So then I think I want to do... Oh, but you know what? Wait a minute. Because now we have rounded edges there. I just love this book. I had to use it again because I really wanted to do these scalloped ones. Don't they have... Oh, here. Teardrops. Okay. So let's take this teardrop. And we'll put it right up against that and guess where the other one's gonna go yeah my spreads are pretty predictable now um, let's go Ooh. I may have to bring this over so this particular bullet journal Don't rip out oh, crap on a cracker. And it's not the page, it's the sticker because, okay, we're just gonna leave it. It's just really, really close. So I think what I'll do, uh, let me see if I can. Let's see how good mama is because I don't have undo. should have undo, but I don't. Ah, so satisfying. Okay, so let's move her over. And then once this goes down, it is never, ever, ever coming up again in its lifetime. All right, there we go. Okay, so at least it's over. There's a little rip mark right there. So we're just gonna cover that up. Now I think what I will do is I will take this one because there's a pretty significant gap there. Like I was saying, I, I got this bullet journal at Walmart because I didn't really know. I didn't want to spend a lot of money on a journal if I didn't know whether I was really going to enjoy doing it. So I think I paid like 12 or $13 or something like that for it. Ugh. And I mean, the paper quality isn't, isn't bad. I know it looks bad here, but this is more along, along, along the lines of the Happy Planner stickers, not my paper. So... Hold on. I see a... It's crinkled a little bit, but that works. Okay. All right. So we're down. We're somewhat symmetrical as far as spacing is concerned, but that's all right. Okay. Um, let's go back to my scalloped boxes again. Let's bring in a black one here and see this is much bigger than that. Let's bring in a gray one up here. We can be a little different. All right, let's grab some more of these beautiful flowers. All right, where do I want to put them? I am just going to put them and put one there, have it come off the page. Okay. I think I would like to do this one. Oh, 
Ooh. There we go. I think we're going to go. I think we're going to cut it. Like that. We're going to bring that one right in there. Although I would really like. Let's see if I could do this. Even if it's just a little leaf just to kind of give it some type of finishing touch over here. There we go. This way at least it doesn't look so unfinished on the bottom. Okay. Okay, let's bring in another flower right here. Oh, here. Um, no. That's nice. I like that. Okay, let's grab a couple more butterflies because the butterflies are freaking beautiful. So I'm gonna put one there. I think I want another one right over here. And actually, I think we're gonna be done. I don't wanna open this up. Ugh, hold on. I don't want to overdo this. I'm trying really not to be like, because I have these places to write, but like these spaces here, I need to be able to leave some more. Um, um, as I say that and I pull out another sticker, I want some now nah, that's fine do I really want that there no I think it kind of ruins the the thing over here well that's pretty cute what happens if I take a butterfly no it's blue Um, I have two pages. What happens if we really make it symmetrical? Which is one thing I love about Jessica's books is the fact that you get two pages. There we go. That's nice. It just kind of adds a little something, something up there. Okay, I'm done. I'm not going to add any more. I do not want to take away from it. I did get to use my scallop boxes, which I'm very excited about. So anyway, guys, this is another undated spread that I will eventually be writing in. I thank you again for joining me, for um, clicking on the video. Would appreciate it if you like what you see. If you could like, subscribe, comment, if you have any you know, comments, good, bad, whatever, um, I can take it. And um, yeah, and that's it. And, and I really do appreciate everybody um, everybody's watch hours and I'm on my road to 1000 subscribers and we will see you guys again in the next video. Bye.